Let's graph the linear equation 2x minus 3y equals 1. And we could use a table of values, put values in for x, get the value for y, and then plot those. Or we could use slope-intercept form. And this actually turns out to be a lot easier than using the table of values here. So let's do that. You get the same graph either way. So I need to reorganize this into slope-intercept form. So I'm going to subtract 2x from both sides. So the 2x cancels out. We get negative 3y equals 1 minus 2x. Now I'm going to divide both sides by negative 3. The 3s cancel out. 1 divided by negative 3, that's negative 1 third plus, plus negative 2 divided by negative 3. That just gives us a positive 2 thirds x. And now I'll switch it so the x is first. And that's our slope-intercept form. So we have negative one-third for b, that's the y-intercept, and that's where we're going to intercept the y-axis. So right about here. So we go up 2 over 3, up 1, 2, and then over 1, 2, 3. Over here we go up 1, 2, over 1, 2, 3. And you can see these all line up here. Let's put a line through it. And that's the graph for 2x minus 3y equals 1. Again, if you used a table of values, you'd get the same graph. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.